Hey everyone, this is Just a Tech, your right to repair guy, and I welcome you all to my YouTube channel. So today's video is very special video. Those who are waiting for the full Windows method for the new A12 Plus bypass tool service from the iPhone XS to the latest 15 Pro Max series. Not only that, you can also bypass the latest iPads, that is the M4 chipset, down to the A12 Plus chipset, whether it's a Wi-Fi model or cellular. Both are supported and also especially for all my just a tech family viewers i have some special discount promo code available in this video so watch the video till the end to know more about it so now without further delay let's start this video all right for this video we will use the latest eye remove tools and now this tool is available for both windows and mac so you can easily use this tool on the latest devices from the iphone xs to the 15 pro max a12 plus series also you you can use it on the Wi-Fi iPads as well as on the cellular iPads from A12 to the latest M4 chipset. For the Mac tool, I have already made the dedicated video on my channel so you can watch that. For Windows, you can follow this guide. You can see that all the important information about this new service is written here so you can pause the video and check it out and as i mentioned especially for my viewers there is an extra discount available on all these prices so you can apply my promo code that is just a tech and you will get the instant discount on this service as well as all the other service available on the website so do check out the description link for the complete information now after that you can simply download the tool Now after that you have to extract the exe installer from it so you can use any zip extractor I'm using the WinRAR so I will extract it on my desktop. Now after that you can simply double click on it and install it on your system. Now once you have installed the tool you can simply run it. After that you can simply connect your device and check the compatibility. First you have to connect the device and make sure it's working on the latest iOS version and then you can connect it and it will check the compatibility whether it's supported or not. But yes sim locked and carrier locked devices are not supported. So you can simply connect with the tool and it will show you the result. Now this is my iPhone 11. I've already registered the device in the server that's why it's showing me the start button directly but in your case first it will check the compatibility and it will ask you to register your device in the tool server so for this i have another device that is currently not registered so i will just show you as an example like how you can register it so you can see that this is my another iphone 12 and it's showing supported on the tool and after that it will ask you to order the service it will open this payment page you can read all this instruction and below that there is a order form here you need to type your name and valid email so that after the registration you will receive the updates and the device registration success information next you have to apply the promo code that is just a tech and just apply it and after that you will see you will get instant discount and this promo code works on all the services that are available on the iRemove tool website now once your device is registered you can wait for the batch timing the batch timing and the other important information i will post it on the screen so you can pause the video and and check it out you just have to wait for the batch timing so that it will complete your processing and after that you can easily activate your device from the tool mostly all the batch complete in the next day excluding the weekend so you can just track it from the tool or you will get the email or you can visit their website or the track page just enter your device detail and it will show you your device is done in the processing or not so let me just show you an example video like how it look like so this device i have already registered and my patches in the processing so let me just show you now if i click on the start it will show me the result that your device is ready for the activation or your order is in the process so now you can see my order is in the process so it will take next day to complete the order so now let me just wait for that and you can confirm the same thing from their order track status page so you can just go to their website and click on the order check now and
and just enter your details and you will get the instant status so after the registration it will look like this we have registered your device your order is still in the process it will take this time and you can just accordingly do that all right now it's a next day and my device is processed now in the batch and batch is completed so now i will just check the status again to confirm so just enter the details same way you will get the status your device is ready for the activation so just click on the check status now let me scroll it down and you will see your order is completed please connect the device to the iremove tool to finish the bypass process so now let's do it okay so now click on start now let's just wait for the bypass to get complete it's in the process all right so within a minute it's done you will see success message on the tool the device has completed the bypass after that your device will take a reboot so just wait for it now you can disconnect your device Alright so we are on the home screen and you can see we have successfully bypassed this device from the iRemove tools in a minute. So everything looks good you can check out. So let me just uh, insert the sim card first and show you the calling is working good as this bypass support the signal also. So now you can see the signals on the top. Let me just place a call. Welcome to three. If your query is about the number you're calling from, press one. If the query is on a different number, press two. So you can see the calling is working good. Let me just show you the mobile data will also work. So I have just turned off the Wi-Fi. Now let me just use my cellular data to open any web page. Okay, so cellular data is also working. Also, this bypass is the untethered bypass, so if you reboot the device, it will not lock again, so you can use your device normally even after reboot. But yes, there is an important point. After the new Apple patch, there are some iServices that is not working like FaceTime, iMessages, notification and some streaming apps. So these things will not work. But other iServices like iCloud Login, Siri, App Store and other features will work. And we are working on it to solve some iServices issue in future update. So just stay tuned for it. If in future update it gets solved, you can easily do re-bypass and enjoy all the services again with a new update. So just stay tuned for that. You can follow me on my telegram channel for all the news and latest update regarding the iOS bypass tools. So now you can see after the reboot it's working good again so untethered way is completely working and you can bypass the latest iOS 17, 17.6, 17 17.6.1 as well and also you can enjoy the fake reset option in the settings. So this feature allow you to erase or reset the iPhone from the settings and the best part is it will not lock again. So by default this feature come with a tool.
so you can see that the quick reset feature is working good so that's all for iRemove tools if you want to register your device you can check out their website and don't forget to apply the promo code that is just a tech that will give you instant discount on all the services that are available on the iRemove tool website so that's all for today's video session i hope you enjoying my content please hit the like button on this video and if you're new here please subscribe to my channel for more cool updates like this i will see you in another video so till then goodbye take care and peace out